Good day everyone, my name is Coopalit, and welcome back to another episode of Inkenfell. Last time, we fought a cat. This time we go further into the dorms and see if we can find Rook to help us get past this heart that's blocking us. Inkenfell is weird. And that's good. It's a magic game, it should be weird. We still haven't found the the ghost key to get through this locked door yet uh we did search everything in here correct i just wanted to check every little piece of furniture or a little piece of wood yeah that was just the instructions on how to get the hallway sorted out so no i suppose i don't think i've checked these guys just real quick and i'm pretty sure i checked these yeah, nothing on the back side of this. No, okay. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll just get that later. Not in there either. All right. Yeah, let's just start moving on. Got a sleepover over there. Well, let's stay on here. More. St just more and more stuff. What's this? There's a note on the wall. For some reason, students have been spending a lot of time in this second stall. Please refrain from monopolizing the toilets, as the rest of us have business to do too. Okay. Oh! Rare gem! Is that boy still sleepy? This is blocked off. I saw a sparkle over here. I thought. Maybe not. Guess not. Must have just been my imagination. Alright, well, there's a door up here. God. <laughs> just never ending stuff. Okay, let's deal with this one first. What are these things? Uh, view units. Sweepy. Is it supposed to be like a play on sleepy? Except cutesy? You're sweepy. Huh. Mary's got two moves before this one moves. But she's not going to be able to really get over here. Get an acid splash on it to get some damage off. Oh, now it's angry. Okay. Well, move here and motivate myself. Eh, still haven't got the great timing down on that yet. Sleep. Oh, it's sleeping heals up its allies. Okay. Hot spit. That's a lot of damage. Um, yeah, it's completely healed up. We want to focus this guy down. It's angry again. And then ignite it. Uh, how do we want forward? There we go. Do anything. Get nice and close and personal. I only got a nice there. But hopefully this will kill. And it does. Nice. Ta da! Mines. Mines. There's just so much stuff. <laughs> this place is. This is like, the, you go into a room, there's two more rooms. Go into one of those two rooms, there's two more rooms. Go into one of the rooms from there, two more rooms. <laughs> I don't actually need to say, I just wanted to get healed. Uh, I like it. It's just, it's a lot all at once. Hearing lots of little dingles around all of these. 
This looks like it's an important room of some kind. What is this? Ooh, treasure chest. Hey, bye. Gold blossom and blue blossom. I remember we got something at the end of the last episode, right? We got equipment. Uh, right, the glass hairpin, which does. Right, this is minus one speed, plus one power. This is plus one defense and plus one speed. Right. So obviously you needed the power, but I wanted you. Well, hmm. Hmm. So we improve her speed, but lower her power a little bit, which is okay. Make it a little bit more defensive since she can heal. But at the same time, it would make me sense for, I say me, Marat, technically to be the one with more speed. Um... Rat gets hit a lot too, and she has one less health. I think I'm gonna keep it as is for now. What the heck is that? <laughs> Great Grump is hangry. Okay. 15. Huh. Can't hit anything from here. Moves. Strangely. Uh, I gotta be next to her to motivate. Motivate Petronella here. Still can't quite get the great. <laughs> uh, that's just gonna be like the story of the entire game. Just waiting desperately for the one day that I actually get a great throw. Uh, also, it's too bad that Petronella's moving here and not Moret, because I can get a nice fireball off in all three. Oh well. Um, they all, they're all going to move before Moret. I guess go for this one. Ah, killed it. Nice. Alright, let's able to reduce some of that. Now what's this thing gonna do? That's freaking me out. Um... Petronella is about to move, so I might be able to... Oh, but if I move here, then Petronella can't move. If I move here, she can. I can attack this guy. Then move back. And do a bubble snap here. Kill that. And completely flubbed that timing. All right, knight this guy. It says he's hangry. I'm wondering. Give it something. It's our only moldy shroom. That's it's really useful bosses. I can give it to this guy. Let's try it. That doesn't seem to have done anything except heal him. So.
It was worth a shot. <laughs> Bubble snap. Let's kill this guy. Oh, come on. I hit that. It was enough. It was enough anyways. <laughs> Swoop. Alright, what's through here? Ooh. Dark. Hey, there's a tiny ghost key. Coin. Let me get into there. Something strange about this wall, but it's too dark to see. So we have to light it up somehow. Yeah, hey, he's angry. Uh, let's see here. Petronella is going to get the chance to move. It's a motivator. Could just go here and do it from cross. There we go. Get that out of the way. Alright, so... I know this thing's 15, that's 10. Petronella should be able to do 9 to the sweepy. But I don't think I can hit it from here except for with fireball. Here. Ooh, I actually, I don't think I can hit it even with fireball because it's not in range. So, in that case, try and kill this guy. I don't think this is going to be quite enough, though. Hmm. So, I really need to get a great hit on that one. Well, it was worth a shot. Didn't even get a great throw on that. Yep. Only healed six. So it should be able to kill it now. Maybe. Oh. Oh. That's what the hangry means. <laughs> um, it's full health now, right? Yep. <laughs> yes, that is an appropriate reaction, Petronella. <laughs> okay then. Hmm. <clears throat> what? The hell? Flipping timings all of a sudden. Still not quite dead, so we're gonna take another hit. <laughs> Barely surviving. I right, should. Even though I'm gonna kill it this round, I'm gonna back off anyways. Just for safety. Level 6. Plus 2 HP, plus 1 power. Ooh, new spell. Blaze. This is just low HP. Uh, what's that spell? Minor burn damage to a large area destroys hidden traps. Ooh, nice. And to compare stance now. Got more power, more life, more speed. Better now, but, you know. Petronella will get stuff the next level, too. 
Oh, that's where the candlelight was hiding. Drawing of a tiny ghost scratched into the wall. Give it a poke. Something stinks in here. Rancid fruit. Ew. <laughs> Wait, there's something else. Heavy earrings. Okay, what's the rancid fruit do first? Decreases defense by four for three turns. Nice. So better moldy shroom. And we got another accessory. This is plus two defense. Okay. Decent. All right, so it looks like this area was just a completely optional area. So now which way is the way to go? I'm assuming down here is the official way to go and this is another optional area. We have to go back. I forgot to go heal. That was a mistake. Okay, well. Salve. What's the range on this? So it's just like a uh, three by three in front or behind me. All right. Motivate myself. Hey! I finally got the grate! Place to trap. And you. I'm gonna go over here. Hmm. Don't really wanna use up one of these. I'm just gonna hang way far back and throw some acid splashes around. Let's see how much a blaze does here. Not expecting that type of attack. I destroyed the trap too. It didn't do huge amounts. One great did two. I'm guessing it does like four. Oh, this is gonna kill Petra now. Dang it. Well. Fireball. And then fireball here. Kill two of them. If I can solo kill this guy, who I've unfortunately not been hitting very well. 9 HP. Add a little hiccup there. Computer. <laughs> Hopefully, no major issues. Oh, come on. Well, now I have to heal myself. the exact amount of damage to me. Bad. Yeah, it's better. Oh, just barely got through that. Not using up any more items. 
Yeah, remember, go back to the kitty. There we go. I suppose while we're back here, see if it's through the store, finally. Another dark room. A ransom fruit and a common coin. Lots of money off of this. Oh, pretty chest. For a second, I was going to think, oh, is it a mimic? But then I remembered, wait, he ended up not using the mimic. I mean, he... <laughs> so at least I don't have to worry about that. Um. Huh? Oh, I guess I was just running up against that tiny little piece of lip. Oh, there you are. Message scratched on the inside of the chest. Got me. Overalls. First one of these we've seen in a while. Uh, just extra defense without the, the speed decrease. Well, in that case... Yeah, give that to Petronella. Proof her speed again. And her defense. Alright, that was worth it. Alright, back up here. Shiny here. Something in the carpet. Oh! Duh! Not where I would have expected a rare gem to be. Good sport. A hat? Yeah. Okay, so this is three defense, this is extra defense, and speed. Well... Make their speeds equal, finally. Get Petronella even more defense, since she is the healer. And got one less HP. Yeah, look at this. Uh, back to finding Rook. Must be down the stairs. Oh, let's see. It's a locked off door here. <laughs> this is funny watching that move. Little snap on this guy. Followed by a fireball here. And another bubble snap. Nice. Gumbled them. Oh! But I'll get to level up. To health and a power, as well as poison. Ooh, I like poison. Come on. Alright, first off, let's look at stats here. So now, equal power! Which means I probably want to make some changes, because I want Moret to have more power. <laughs> now she has more defense and more HP. Um, how do we do this then? Okay, this gives more speed. So what I'm gonna do... Do that over here. I think it's time to retire the red earrings off of her. Or... What's the difference here? One less speed, one more defense. But I really have the, the red earrings on her. So do this. Earrings, that's a lot less speed. Sweater. Rolls. Uh, 
the loafers over. I need to keep the speed relatively high. Loafers here. So we got one less HP, but one more defense on Moret. Two more power, one more speed. Compared. I think that's a good balance there. Need to go and heal. Yeah, again. <laughs> Luckily, it's just... The nice thing about having the, the two rooms off of two rooms off of two rooms is that it's only three rooms away to get back to the cat. <laughs> and obviously, it's not exactly two rooms off of two rooms off of two rooms, but, you know. The, the branching paths means it's not as far to get to the root of the tree. This is it. I guess this is Brooks' room. A little shop over there. Watch this. Oh, that's back towards the start. That locked door from earlier. Being the ghost is not that easy, I'll tell ya. The things you get up to when they think nobody's watching. Ugh. Alright, well, I can finally buy some more stuff. Uh, first off, sell 120 clicks. I have no use, but it's worth its weight in gold. Yes, it is. Alright, sell that stuff. Uh, buy a couple of blue blossoms. Buy another sweet sprout. Use the defense by four for three turns. Uh, the stuff we already had. Yeah. Think we're good for now. This isn't anything? Nope. All right. Let's meet Rook. Is he asleep? You think we should come back later? That's not Rook. Ooh, what voice do I do for her? Oh, visitors. It's about time. Over to Mag much? Oh, ho, ho, ho. This is my lucky day. G Gilda? Well, what are you doing sitting here in the dark? Where's Rook? R Rook? You've only got one person to worry about right now, Nell. And that's me. Gilda, what are you talking about? Oh, no, you wouldn't believe it. I've always, magic's always been so weak, right? Fizzling out, blowing up in my face, everyone laughs at me. But then I heard this loud crack and felt a huge surge of energy. Wait, that's like... And then something happened. Something. Magnificent! What? What's that? L l lightning? Oh! Isn't it just so... me? Gilda, how did you get such a power? I love the animations on Gilda, by the way. Just a little sprite. That's not important right now. What's important is this lovely new friend you brought here. She looks tough. Is she tough? This is Moret, Safina's sister. Yeah, she's really strong. We're actually looking for her. S Safina has a, a hot sister? <laughs> oh, is she gay? We must duel! We d don't want to have to fight you, Gilda. What? Yes, you will. Because if you can't beat me, I'll tell you what happened to Safina. 
Or if you can be, I'm just guessing. I think I misread it. You, you know? When you make up your mind, you know right to find me, cutie. Uh, she's a treat. Super sprout. Pink hair band. Clearly that's her side of the room. Flashy tie. Clearly this is Brooke's side of the room. <laughs> hey! Storytelling through items. Alright. Uh, flashy tie. What's it actually do? Plus one power. Minus one defense. Plus one speed. This is plus one power. Minus one speed. Just, just better. Okay, uh, it does reduce my defense, though. Uh, do I want to... That just gives me more defense, so... Uh, that gives me speed. Makes me super speedy. Well, what does the hairband do? Oh, that's also an accessory. I was thinking it was going to be a hat, because, you know... It's a hat. <laughs> but I guess you can have a pink hairband and a bandana at the same time. It'll look a little weird. Uh, plus three speed. That's a lot of speed. That's a lot of speed. Yeah, it's fast locking all the gate, too. Alright, well, we want the power here. Glass hairpin was plus one defense, plus one speed. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Think about defense here. I'm going to be back down to 14 speed, but give me one more defense. But I think I'm just going to try out this combo. Oh, we never looked at poison, right? Damage and poison an enemy, damage it over several turns. Well, we know who to try that out on. Alright, kitty. Beast restored. Alright, let's do this. I hope you're ready, because it's showtime. What is it like to be loved and so adored? That was fast. This is so fast. <laughs> that was exactly my thought. She's tough too, but if we can pin down her timing. my own timing <laughs> trying to let the song play a little bit uh, oh yeah this is just my highest damage spell oh I should actually look 80 HP Someday I will get it. Just be 
Oh, this is getting good. Let's see how you handle this. <laughs> Minus one speed. All right. That is a hilarious animation, though. Uh, well, now would be a good time. Uh, da, 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 da. Moldy shroom. And a bubble snap. Yet. Surrounded. Uh, I'm gonna get a little closer. And you'll mash yourself up. More exposition. I. Why am I not winning? I'm doing so terribly. I'm better than this. Okay, then don't step there. Okay? Ouch. Well, let's see here. I think just motivating myself would be best here. Although I need to leave room for Petronella to move around. Wow, really just boxing Petronella in here, aren't you? I'll go for Salvin. Oh, that's the first time I haven't gotten a grade on that. So many shock traps. Okay, well... How much HP she got left? 17. Can I hit her with an acid splash or a poison? I wonder if that poison works like after each like little move she's doing. It also doesn't do that much damage, but then again, neither does the acid splash. So let's try it. So let's hope to do like around six damage. Uh, okay, that's about safe. <laughs> it's like I couldn't remember if it was. You know, that spot or the spot right there. <laughs> Alright. Ignite. They're everywhere. So it is after each like, individual little move. Okay. Good to find out here. Um... Hmm. I only got five left. 
I can't reach her without moving one more forward into a trap. So... Well, I mean, this area down here is still safe. There's so many traps, like, right above me here. I guess and turn and hope she doesn't target me. I think there's one right in front of Maret here now. But I can get over here. Hmm. The good ignite might just finish her off. Well. Oh, it did. Defeat a Gilda. She mad locked. Oof, she mad. Sweet cake and a rare coin. Ooh, nice. Oh, what? Hey. Zephina thinks she's so great. She's never lost a duel. But I defeated her. I'm the first. She doesn't get to look down on me anymore. Seth was pretty beat up. That's when Headmistress Eldra showed up. She was furious at Safina about something. Headmistress took her away, but I don't know where to. I'll see you again. And next time I'll wait. Ugh, so cute. Well, at least we finally learned something. But we still don't know where Safina is. We need to get into Saf's room. I have a feeling whatever's there will lead us to her. If we can only find Rook. Well then. Hello, Zim Mills. Save our file here. Guess we still don't know quite where Rook is. We'll have to try and hunt him down so we can get into the room and keep trying to find Safina. Which I think is probably going to be something we're going to be working on like the entirety of this game. <laughs> is trying to find Safina. There is a lot of game left in case you couldn't tell by the map. <laughs> like we just finally cleared out this one building and there's building there, there's building there, there's building there, there's, there's that. Iron maze up there, is a tower there, building over there, building over there, building over there, building there, tower there, building there, building there, some gardens and stuff over there, whole chunk of the forest up there, there's a bit of the forest down over here. There's a lot of game left. <laughs> but I am still thoroughly enjoying my time. And someone has a crush on my <laughs> But I think that will be it for now. And I will see you guys next time.